Hello everyone and welcome back. Today we're going to be checking out California. Last episode we were talking about Yosemite and some dinosaurs Yosemite. hanging around out there. Over 1,000 square miles in size. It is home to one of the oldest plant species on Earth, the giant sequoias, which have been growing in this part of California for over 60 million years. That could be our connection. What's drawing the dinosaurs here? The sequoias are familiar part of their genetic memory. Then this land could be a perfect fit for the dinosaurs. So we've got our arrival point down, and it's not really connected to anything, so let's see about putting in basically all of the other things. Uh, we need a guy here. In constraints. There we go. So putting it too close to that other building will bump it into the pad that it creates for itself. Okay. Let's put in center and terrain constraints again. I like to kind of like line these up all right next to each other. Position center, we're going to need one of those. So I'll put you kind of close there. And the staff center. Be able to put the power behind the staff center pretty easy. The fonts facility for sure gonna need one of those. Uh, path all these guys together. Right down the middle. There we go. Uh, find your little D. Hey, there we go. There we go. They're all connected. Now we need to slap down some power. That should power all of our operations over here. And then I think we were short one building, the Paleo Medical Facility. We can get that rotated around and slap down about there. I think it's probably going to be a little bit out of the way for the power, but we're we're already going to need more power anyways. Okay, we got all of that. We're going to need an enclosure soon, but we're waiting for that to uh, finish up. We can speed things up just a touch. Done. We have all of the facilities that we need. How are you at photography? Uh, in what aspect? I think my right side is a little better than my left. Oh, and I'm talking about the dinosaurs. We're going to want images of the species in Yosemite. Oh, and you're wrong about the right. Okay, I get it now. We can take one of the vehicles and go on a photo expedition. And, yeah, I know, my left is better. You're still here? I'm leaving, but I haven't left. Get it? Do it up. Play out. Go. Oh. Gone, gone. I'm gone. <laughs> we have here. I don't actually see any. Oh, I got a compi. Submit that. Hopefully we'll be able to pick some of those up. What else we got? I don't see anything big that's just kind of sticking up out of the ground. But it looks like we got a group of things off to the left and to the right. Let's cruise on over there. What are those? Oh, there's a Triceratops. Actually quite a few of them. A lot of money. There was ooh, some hadrosaurs back in the back. Yeah, I'm gonna pass on these things on the oh no, they're right there. Might as well grab those. Yep, 
Yeah, composition is probably terrible, but okay. We get those hadrosaurs. I know that's something we don't already have. It's amazing to see these animals in something so close to their natural habitat. These photographs are like we're not just capturing the dinosaurs, but a moment in time. Which, considering how they got here, feels doubly weird. I think this is as close as we'll ever get to seeing the dinosaurs the way they were 65 million years ago. And it's breathtaking. Those things are huge. I want to get those guys back down by the uh, other bit. Yeah, terrible reward, because that was a terrible photo. I just needed to get a picture of them. Now that we're going downhill, we ought to get there just a touch faster. Really hope we get some compies, because they apparently play nice with basically everything out here. High on my list for sure. Some Pachycephalosaurus. Erichosaurus. Sigma Lich. Malak. That's the one I couldn't say last time. Okay, I'll submit that one. As far as I know, we're not doing this for the money. Oh boy, there's some water there. Yeah, this isn't... I'm gonna say this isn't quite as fun as, like, the Jeep and the uh, go-fast mode. Oh, solitary, probably that Baryonyx. There we go. Not a lot of money, but that's okay. A lot of those. Got them. We need our remote capture teams bringing back the most dangerous dinosaurs. The safety of the public and the dinosaurs are both at stake. I'm your man. And, uh, and I'm your man. I know. Once we have them, we'll get them secured within our new facility. And I know. So be careful. Okay, so we've got one enclosure. Uh, we're probably going to have to build out this way a lot. We actually do a path through here. Yeah, it looks like we can. But I'm going to go ahead and path my way around this thing so that I know that I've got space so that I can get to places. There we go. Should be able to put in a relatively thin enclosure over here. Take it. Boom. Okay, got all that. <clears throat> I'm going to make that the Baryonyx enclosure. And once that's done, we should be able to go ahead and start putting in environmental stuff. So, a little bit of water. A little bit of water. Uh, we also need gates to get in. Get in. Uh, we also need facilities. And there, and how about one more?
That ought to get all of that. Gotta connect them up with the paths. Got that taken care of. And that should give us enough room for a power right here. Good. Uh, so let's uh, let's grab our capture team at its task, and let's go find that uh, Baryonyx. Do they show up on the map? They sure don't. Maybe this is what those flares are for. Oh, expeditions. Okay. You can't capture these wild ones. Which the story kind of led me to believe we were supposed to be doing. Oh, well. Okay, let's view our expedition map, see what we've got. Uh. I don't know what that is. Uh, Trodon. Albertosaurus. Uh, Metricanthosaurus, Dilophosaurus, Herrerasaurus, and Allosaurus. Oh, well, we've had Allosaurus before, but we've never had Herrerasaurus. Let's grab one of those. Grab you and you. Uh, that oh, work. And we'll, we'll kind of... We'll get out of here, and we'll go into a little bit faster mode. Should be able to fit them in here fairly easily. While we wait for that to come back, even in fast mode, build us some additional enclosure. Actually, is there really any point in not having that connected up? Not that I can see. Let's demolish that useless segment. Hey, there we go. Three Herrerasaurus found. Okay. Um, let's see. Let's let's transport them over here into this new area. Asset has been collected. So, for them to be okay, we're definitely going to have to add them some water. Well, or not. Uh, let's see about getting them a observation facility. Asset delivery confirmed. Observation. Gate. Let's also get them one these. That means we also need Ranger Team. I want you to come check these guys out. While you do that, we're going to change the time back down to normal speed. And slap down a couple more of these observation posts. And a pathway. That ought to be good. And we need their water. Stream. Oh, there we go. Got him a little bit of water. See what these guys take. Check them, please. What you're here for. Uh, undiagnosed ailment and missing forest. So, let's see. Need forest. That should give us a little bit more time to work on the other stuff. Okay. Should be taken care of. Comfort. Uh, population 3. You're a little bit low. You need prey and you need more forest. So, go ahead and... That was the wrong one.
fixed. And you need more forest. So I think I have officially covered this entire place with forest. They ought to be okay. Just barely. Okay, cool. Let's go over to our area over here with the uh, mobile vet unit task. And we want you to check out these Herrera sorters. Really? You don't want to do that? Okay. We will manually pilot you over there. And more people to run into. I like how the fences carry power now. It was one of the uh, headaches from the last one. Random tree right there. Yeah, these facilities are actually kind of nice. please and please you're not scanning why are you not scanning if we can find one of the other ones also still not scanning okay then Are you not scanning? No oh, ailments detected. You're still low on forest. None of you are sick now. How are, how are none of you sick now? Okay then. So since they need more forest, what we're going to do is we're going to slightly cordon off that. So as soon as that fence builds, uh, we'll we'll clear that out and we'll give them just a bit more forest. We basically replaced everything in here with forest. Still like more forest, please. Let's uh demolish the. See how they're doing. If we can find them. But let's just check on this dude. They're expanding their uh, their area. They need more water, and they're officially okay on forest. Water. Can we? There we go. Water. You're you're basically standing in it. We can give you more though. I think. Yeah, still missing water. Not sure what's going on there. That's about as much water as I can give you, friend. Yeah, I'm looking at their um, their range, and they'll they'll explore a little bit more. They should be good on water soon. Why is that only three percent? Maybe we need to flatten.
That should give us a bit more place for water. There we go. There's no way you should be able to be missing water right now. We'll just leave you be. And let's start our next expedition. We got uh Albertosaurus. Not something that we have. But I think the two Allosaurs probably gonna be worth just a touch more. We can take you. Then we can take you. Off you go. And looking at the time, I think that's going to call it for the episode. Uh, we took some pictures of some dinosaurs and sent out some uh, expeditions to go get us some more. And uh, we'll see where that gets us in the next one. Well, it looks like that's going to do it for us today, guys. I wanted to say thank you for hanging around this long. If you did and you haven't already hit subscribe, please do. Uh, just so you don't miss out on any of the other cool stuff coming on down the road. If you'd like to hang out with us, please hit us up on Discord. Link is in the About section on the channel, or you can go to discord.onesnot.com, and I will see you guys in the next one.